Hey guys, what's going on? As you can see, I'm editing right now. Got some uh, scary music in this. Um, so I'm going to start a new series on the channel. Uh, hopefully, uh, eventually we're going to get some more people involved in this. I won't say who yet, but... Um, so, uh, I, I'm i going to put up the video. I don't know if I caught anything. I'm going to actually review the footage. But this will be the first video of the series, a uh, new series. A uh, group I'm going to put together um, consisting of other famous horror YouTubers, uh, at least in our world, you know. Um, we're going to call ourselves the uh, the Scream Crew. Uh, basically, we're going to go out and ghost hunting and stuff like that. Uh, various locations, we have not decided where yet, but uh, uh, it's in the works, it's in the talks right now. Uh, you should ex expect more, more of this maybe closer to July, August. So, yeah. Um... The footage you're about to see right now is actual um, stuff caught on on, on camera. Uh, so I'm not gonna tell you where this is just for the for the um, the safety of who filmed this. Um, I'll just tell you as a family member, uh, I, I gave him the thing so he could take it to his uh, to his work. Um, I won't say where it's at. I won't say who it is. Uh, just for the sake of uh, keeping their identity anonymous and stuff like that and uh, so no one gets fired over this or anything but um basically in his break room the uh, the break room's haunted so basically he was explaining it to me like this that um, I guess in the break room it's pretty it's pretty dark in there so there's not a lot of light the only, the only light they'll get when they eat lunch in there is from their phones either when they're watching like uh, something on their phone like from YouTube or something like that and um, one of the co-workers one day came out and told him that he saw something in there uh, more or less uh, a chair moving on its own so that was like the backstory My, uh, the person didn't believe him so he asked me if I can if he can use my ghost tracker which is happens to be in my pocket <laughs> he gave it to me he asked if he can use this uh, if you guys don't know what this is, it's the EMF meter. Uh, basically, you turn it on like so, and the lights will go uh, to like yellow and everything uh, if there's a, uh, any uh, electromagnetic field. Um, so you got to be careful when you're around electronics not to use that too much uh, if you're trying to go ghost hunting. So he used that, uh, and here's the footage. This is 100% real, nothing's been tampered with. Um, the only thing that's been tampered with, obviously, is me editing the clips in, trying to clear them up a little bit, but they're at the best quality they can be. They were filmed off an iPhone and sent through via text messages, so I'm sorry if the quality's not clear, but this is what he caught at work today, um, and I'm very excited to be bringing you this as the first episode. So thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned to the end. Uh, maybe I can give you more details of what's going on. Bye.
Alright guys, so that was the footage. I thought that was actually pretty insane. Um, I'm very much looking forward to going ghost hunting with some people over the summer. Of course, George might be with me. Um, and there's, I'm talks with other YouTubers right now. I won't say who, just to keep it secrecy and stuff like that. But yeah, guys, inspiration uh, for this series and to start this crew uh, comes from the league. They made a ghost hunting video like a month or two ago. I'm going to link, link the video in the description below. Um, so yeah, check out their channel. Leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff over there. If you guys like these type of videos, leave a like here. I'm going to put up maybe another video soon. i gotta, I got to review the footage first, uh, so don't expect another one of these for a while. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.